Hey everyone, how's it going? So I've been having a lot of fun coming up with new different types of titans and different types of creatures like that. And in honor of Shark Week, I thought it'd be fun to show you guys how to draw my version of a shark titan. So I hope you guys really like this, and if you have any ideas for other different kind of like animal titans, definitely let me know. But I hope you guys enjoy this, and thanks for watching. Now to start off with our shark titan, we're going to begin with the eye. So I'm going to start right up here and I'm going to just draw a little line. It's just going to go down and it's going to come up like this in a check mark shape. Starting here, we're going to make a little curved line for a circle with a little line that's just going to come down here. Now I'm going to color in most of this, just leave a little bit white at the top, kind of like how sharks eyes roll back into their head. Make this come out a little farther. Starting here, I'm just going to make a little line. It's just going to go up and down. And then starting here, I'm going to draw a little line. It's just going to come up. Then I'm going to bring it back down to here. Going to draw this line. It's going to come up and it's going to come back down like this. Then it's going to come out here. Draw a little line, it's going to go down and over to kind of form the lip. I just want to come in here and add a little curved line. Now in here we want to give our little shark titan some big teeth. So I'm going to just make some big kind of pointy teeth in here. And then we'll do the same thing down here. We're just going to make some big pointy teeth all the way across here. Next, I'll make a line that's going to go down and it's going to come up here. And then I'm going to make a couple more little curved lines here. Next, I'm going to draw a line that's going to go over and then it's going to come down. And then I'm going to come up here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to go up and then down, for kind of like a spike. We'll do a couple more here, we'll do another one. It goes up and down, and then one more here. Starting here, I'm going to add a couple more of these little curves, and then I'm going to draw a line that's going to go down and then over, kind of start the chest. Starting here, I'm going to make a line that's going to come down. Then we're going to bring this line down to like a big point, and then we're going to bring it up. Make another line that's going to come down and up. And another one right here. Make a line that's going to go up and then down, or up and in, up and in. I'm going to do this a few more times just to kind of give it like a little bit of like a thin kind of pointed look. We're going to bring it up and then connect to here. I'm going to do the another arm over here, so I'm going to draw a line that's just going to come up. I'm going to make it come down to a point. And a line's going to come out and then down. Out and then down here, or down and up, and down and up like this. But we want to make those same points that we did here, so all we're going to do is just go down and then bring it up. Do another one here, down and up, and down and up. Next, I'm going to draw a line that's going to come down here, and then I want to work on the leg. So to draw the leg, I'm going to make a line that's going to come down, and then it's going to go in. And I'm going to make a little bit of a curve on it, and I'll add another little line or two here. Next, I'm just going to draw a line that's going to come out, and then it's going to come back here. Draw another one that's going to go down and it's going to curve to here. And then we'll make one that's going to, oops, sorry, kind of went off the page a little bit. Then we're going to make a line that's going to come down and then it's going to go up here. 
Then I'll make one more out here. The line's going to go up and in. And then we're just going to curve this line around. Then starting out here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to go out and it's going to come down. We'll make a little line that's just going to curve up and then down. We'll do another one right here. And one more that's going to go down and up. Or make this go out and then we're just going to bring it up to here. Now, starting up here, we want to make a line that's going to curve up and then it's going to come down for like the big shark fin. I'm going to make some little lines that are going to just come in, just show that there's some kind of cuts on it. Then we're going to draw this line that's just going to come down. Next, I'm going to take this line. I'm going to draw a line that's going to come up. Make a big line that's going to come up and then down. Little line that's going to go out and in. And one more that's going to go down and then it's going to come up. Then starting here, I'm going to make a line that's going to go down. It's going to get nice and wide as it comes back to here, down by the foot. Now we have our basic Shark Titan right here. Now we just want to come in here and add some different details on it. So I'm going to start right up here. I'm just going to add a little curved line for the nose. And then I'm just going to add a little kind of broken line that comes around here for the mouth and a couple quick little lines in there. I'm going to add a couple little kind of extra spikes on top of the head. And then I'm going to make some little kind of long hook shapes for like where the gills would be. And I'm going to add a couple little extra lines around them. I'm going to add some small claws on the end of here so it doesn't look so much like a wing. And I'm going to add a few little extra lines on there for some details. Do the same thing over here, just a little curved line at the end of each one. Then you can just throw a little line or two on here to show some extra details. I'm going to add a couple little lines right around here. And a couple little detail lines on there. I'll make some long lines that come right up here. A little line or two. And a couple little line or two right there. I'm going to add some extra little details kind of right around here. And a couple little lines over here too. And a couple little ones here. I'm going to add a kind of like this big broken line here kind of where the knee would be. And I'm going to add some little curved lines for like the claws on the toes. And a couple of extra lines right around here. Some extra lines here. And a couple of lines over here. I'm going to add like an extra little kind of shark fin over here. Then on the tail, I'm just going to add a couple little extra lines right around here. Add some more kind of broken lines coming down here. Then I'm just going to make kind of like this wavy line that's just going to come all the way down here. Just to kind of show where there's a little bit of differences and some color. Add a couple more little extra lines onto the fin up here. And we're going to put a couple little curved lines onto the body. And maybe a couple more here on the knee. And there you go. There is your drawing of a Shark Titan. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed.